Mr Speaker, the families of the 43,000 care home residents who lost their lives will be appalled at the former Health Secretary attempting to rewrite history, an attempt that will turn to ashes along with his TV career. We need more humility and less celebrity from the member for yeah, West Suffolk, yeah, and above all, we need answers. Yeah. Mr Speaker, throughout the COVID pandemic, Ministers repeatedly claimed they threw a protective ring around England's care homes and always followed the evidence and scientific advice. But WhatsApp messages from the former Health Secretary revealed in today's Telegraph suggest nothing could be further from the truth. Can the Minister now confirm that the Chief Medical Officer first advised the Government to test all residents going into care homes in early April 2020. Can she explain why the former Health Secretary rejected this advice and failed to introduce community testing until the 14th of August, a staggering four months later? Can she publish the evidence that following the advice would have muddied the waters, yep. as the member for West Suffolk claimed? And can she confirm that 17,678 people died of COVID in care homes between the CMO's advice and the government finally deciding to act? She should know, Mr Speaker, because she was responsible for care homes at the time. Yeah. Now, former ministers are touring the studios this morning, claiming this delay was simply because there weren't enough tests. Where is the evidence for this? And even if tests were in short supply, why weren't care home residents prioritised yeah. when the devastating impact of COVID was there for all to see? Now, Mr Speaker, nobody denies that dealing with COVID was unbelievably difficult, especially in the early days. But care home residents and staff were simply not a priority. Yet the former Prime Minister and Health Secretary were first warned about the emerging horror in care homes by my honourable uh, friend, the member for Hove, in March 2020. Yep. I myself raised the lack of testing in care homes with the Health Secretary. On the 8th of April, the 28th of April, the 19th of May and the 17th of June, long before the CMO's advice was finally followed. The Minister will no doubt say all these issues will be looked at in the public inquiry, but the findings from this won't be available for years. Mr Speaker, the families of the 43,000 care home residents who lost their lives will be appalled at the former Health Secretary attempting to rewrite history, an attempt that will turn to ashes along with his TV career. Career. We need more humility and less celebrity from the member for yeah, West Suffolk. Yeah, and above all, we need answers. Yeah. Yeah.